Hello everyone, and welcome back to Fay Farm. I'm Sophia Bobie, and let's get straight into this game. Let's see, we need to bring diced roots to Nepi. I'm trying to remember what that consists of. Diced roots. Diced roots. Ah, turnips. Okay. So we're still waiting for our turnips to grow. Let's see. Um, what's here? Oak lumber? Alright. If I remember correctly, we were making something. From the house. Let's see what it was. Ah, this. Small bench. It must be that, right? Or maybe it was this. Small bookshelf or small bench? Well, we can make a small bench. We just need one copper ingot. Let's see. Let's see if we can make a copper ingot. Build it. Perfect. Nice. The house is kind of small, don't you think? Hmm. Oh well. Oh, mail! Merit, dear Roby, it's nearly Petal Bloom Festival time. The town will be resplendent with flowers. I might need a little bit of help, though. Can you come see me, please? Ooh, quest for Mayor Merit? Let's do it. Uh, how do we get to the map? There we go. Merit first. There we go. Is this the town hall? Hello, Merit. Hi. Hello, Bobby. Oh, I like pretty much all vegetables. It takes a mix to make a stew, I always say. Uh -huh. Bobby, welcome to Zoria's most colorful time of year, the Petal Bloom Festival. I think it really shows off our island in the prettiest way, don't you? Why, thank you. I can't help but think that something's missing, though. There simply aren't enough flowers. We can't have a half bloomed festival. Would you help me by planting some seeds? You'd have my gratitude and a fabulous prize, too. Grow and collect all sorts of flowers to celebrate petals and bloom. Plant 15 flower seeds? Oh my god. You're a lifesaver. Let's see. I believe this is what we need. 15? My god. She really wants me to work hard on this quest. Okay, I don't even know where I'm going to fit 15 flowers. Anyways, let's check out the other quest in this area. What's this? Why does that have a question mark? Hey, Eddie. Brand new welcomes you, occupant. You must be filled with joy at the receiving of a promotional flyer. Grand you knows you must be very impatient to begin your visit. Mm. Hello, welcome. What can Grenu do for you? Quest, please. Think of Grenu as your chauffeur to the thrilling Archipelago Park. Now, get in my mouth. Some confusion? Hesitation at entering Grenu's magical mouth? Bah, there is no place safer. You can trust Grenu. Come. Good, your trust will be rewarded with a memorable excursion. Make sure to speak to Grenu once we get there. What? Your mouth. Alright. 
Interesting. Mm. What? <laughs> what in the world? This is so weird. Mm. Ren, you welcomed you, occupant. You must be. F okay, same thing. Tummy travel. You see, there is nothing to fear. You are unharmed and now ready to meet your host. Lem waits you. Okay. Interesting. What's the map for this area? There we go. <laughs> what is that? Water lily. Ugh. I can't catch any of these animals. They move too fast. Okay, lem, huh? Man. Oh, recipe! Lily pad fan wallpaper. Okay. Yay! Don't forget to tell your friends about us. You must be bubbling with joy and excitement to see my wonderful park. And I won't keep you long. There's just a couple things I must speak to you about. Ahem. Allow me to officially welcome you to Archipelago Park. The critterous place on, in all the ocean. Now I'm certain that is a word. Anyway, the park houses all your favorite critters and some that you haven't ever seen. I'd also like to congratulate you on being our first ever park patron, and I'm overjoyed to give you your very own critter conch. What? Yes, it's very exciting. With your current conch, you can communicate with croakers? That is to say, critters who speak the language croaker. It's mainly frogs. But the real goal of communication is to collect little rifts that the critters drop. They can be used to buy trinkets from the gift shop. Tell you what, explore the island and find a frog to chat with, and then come back here and tell me all about it. Better yet, have them come too. Befriend a critter that speaks croaker. Okay. Stupendous. Find me your frog and I'll teach you even more about the language of crit languages of critters. Don't forget to visit the gift shop. Dear lord. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> For the runaround, my friend. I'm so taken aback to hear you speaking my tongue that I got a little skittish. What can I do for you? Follow me. This is so weird. Welcome back! I love a repeat visitor. You made a friend! How wonderful! And they've got a little magic broom. Oh, my heart bursts with pride that, the hum that my humble amusement park could bring such joy. There are more languages to learn, more critters to befriend, and more trinkets to buy in the gift shop. And you can keep track of all of it from your very own buddy binder. Buddy binder. Now that you, now you keep that somewhere safe, and you can use it to track and call on all your, the critter pals you've made. Okay. Is that it? My favorite critter comrade is back. This has been a lot already, but I can tell you already, you are already in interested in upgrading your critter cons so you can speak to more critters. Good news! When you success successfully con a critter, they'll drop a riff. Collect enough rifts and you'll be able to upgrade your critter conch. What's a riff? You'll know it when you see it. You've probably already seen them. Anyway, I can see that you're itching for a task. How about you go earn enough rifts to upgrade your critter conch? You'll need money as well, but these don't... But what doesn't these days, eh? Critter riff, huh? Fantastical. You'll have the best time. Your excitement is radiating off you. What? Interesting. Oh my god, he has a broom. Uh... It would seem you've caught me by surprise, tall friend. Sorry for my initial surprise. What can I do for you? Uh, goodbye. Yes! <laughs> Froggy wallpaper. What is this guy? Whoa! What in the world is this? Huh. 
Net isn't strong enough. Wow. Okay. Let's find another frog. Let's find another frog. Wow. This place is crazy. Croatia <laughs> tile flooring. Wow. Interesting. Okay. I'm kind of shook. This is crazy. Oh, ah! yeah. There must be another frog around here. Oh, I can't see. There we go. Perfect. Goodness, many apologies. Okay, yes. Goodbye. Clear rift. Is that all I need? Just a couple? How many do I need? Where is... Uh... I need to pick up one more critter rift. Okay. Let's go this way. I love that he has a magic broom, that's so cute. Okay, I need to find one more frog. Could they be down here? Maybe. Huh, I don't see any more. Bummer. Maybe I'll have to come back. Oh! Goodness. Goodbye. Rift! Okay. Now let's go back to the guy. Okay, what does the quest require now? Upgrade to an amateur critter conch. Okay, we can do that. Upgrade to an amateur critter conch. Man, so many tools in this game. What? Where are we? Oh man, I'm lost. Oh, here he is. Great conch. Amateur critter conch. Woo! Another beautiful day in my pal park paradise. Redeem quest. You have the air of a critter scholar already. Talk to me after. Talk to him after me, no doubt. Okay. Welcome back. I love a repeat visitor. Yes, yes, yes. You see, I have a wonderful gift shop filled with trinkets. What's so special about these trinkets, you ask? Well, let me tell you. They're magical, rare, and very pretty. Each one grants a special bonus. The higher the trinket level, the higher the bonus. Plus, they make a great critter accessory. Now, these beauties, they don't come for free. You'll need some polished gems and florins, but they sh the benefit surely outweighs the price. There's no souvenir better than a trinket from the, Ar the Archipelago Park. I can tell you that you agree. Purchase a trinket. Click a trinket. Marvelous. Do what it takes to buy to purchase a trinket and equip it on your critter. You will not regret it. I'll come back for that. I've got other things to do. 
Okay, I need to plant 15 flowers, right? Okay, let's go plant flowers. Let's make sure that's what the quest says. Plant 15 flower seeds, yeah. Okay. That means I need to buy 15 flower seeds. Do I have any flower seeds? Uh, no. Okay. I need to buy flower seeds. Let's buy flower seeds. Who sells flower seeds? You? Ah. Trees? I forget who sells flower seeds. Do you sell flower seeds? Ah. Oops. No, I, I don't want to talk to you. <laughs> that sounds bad. Mm, no. Do you sell flower seeds? Fruit trees? No. How about you? Nope. Nope. How about you? Does nobody here sell flowers? Interesting. How about you? Carpentry services. Oh, carpentry services. Okay, none of them. Who sells flowers then? Is it Pearl? Hey, Cleo. Um. Hmm. I'll have to look it up. <sighs> or I could just wander around aimlessly for a day. But I want to buy those flower seeds. Soil bed. Okay, we need silt and oak logs now. I guess I should go to bed. Alright, let's let it load and I will look up where to buy flower seeds. We made we made eighty six. That's it. Wow. Okay. Rosalind. Ah, thank you. Okay. Oh, my plants are <gasps> yay. Perfect. Now we need to make 20 dice fruits. There we go. Okay, we'll let that go. And then, what else do you do? Ah, yes. Let's buy more turnip seeds, first of all. How many do we need? Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, 12. 12 seeds. And then we'll find Rosalind and buy flower seeds. Hello, I need 12 from you. 12 of these. Ooh. There we go. Thank you. Pleasure doing business with you. Okay, now let's plant. This 
this. Uh, this guy. These three. Yeah. One of these. Two of these. My bad. Okay. Man, I need to plant more cauliflower. That's okay, we'll do that later. First we gotta find Rosalind. No. Rosalind. There we go. <sighs> Rosalind, please. Seven plus eight is fifteen. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay, let's plant. The yellow tulip. There. I gotta remember that. Yellow tulips on the left. And then I need silt and oak logs. Is this oak? Oh, that was not my intention. Okay. Beach logs. Okay, that's not oak. Okay, let's go find some oak. Dig silt. Any over here? No? Hmm, maybe that's also up there. That's not silt. Mulch. Am I gonna find. Maybe the beach? Or just over here somewhere. You never know. See if we can dig up silt. Hmm. I don't see silt anywhere. Not what I need. I need silt. Hmm. 
Maybe over here? Hmm. Interesting. I don't see any silt anywhere. This is so frustrating. I hate that they don't put the resources enough in this game. Ooh! Oh my god, thank god. Okay, that should be enough for now. Let's go plant some flowers. Okay, so which one is here? Oops. Yellow, right? Yellow, yes. Okay, let's put... There we go! Now we need to go to Mayor Merit. Where is Mayor Merit? Let's find her. Oh, a new quest, huh? Whew. And then I need to bring the diced roots to Neppy. Fair. How you doing, Bobby? Woo! Well done, Bobby! Hi! Okay. Make us three more beautiful flowers. Build and place three decorative items made with flowers. Oh dear. I'm not going to be able to do that. Let's do the Dice Root quest. God, I planted so many flowers. Okay. Now let's go to next one. some copper and stuff soon, aren't we? What do we have? Only 22 copper. Oh, man. We have clay. We have coal. We need more stone. We need more copper. Should I get some copper on the way? Yeah, let's get some copper. Let's go here and get some copper. Okay, what else? We need some topaz. There we go. Alright. Let's go to the next one. See if we can find copper there. There we go. There we go. Any more over here? Yes. 
Oh man, my energy is so low. Alright. Perfect. That's probably enough for now. Let's see, how much do we have now? 58. Perfect. That's good. There we go. Whew. I love having that frog sell a broom behind me. It's so cute. There we go. Return to Neppy. Hi, Neppy. Splash, sploosh, wee, whoosh. Redeem the quest. You're back! And I could spell all my ingredients. This is gonna be so fun. Even more fun than swirling around a whirlpool. I'm gonna start preparing the feast. Come back tomorrow and we'll have a little picnic. Then we'll deal with those whirlpools. I just can't wait. You must believe that I'm not fooling. After we eat, we'll undo the whirlpooling. Go to the whirlpools with Neppy in the morning. Okay. Bye, Neppy. Don't freeze on me, game. Come on. Ah. Oh, there we go. Okay. We're good. Now let's exit. So in the morning we'll come back to Nippy. Man, I am so low on energy. What? What's that? Is that a romance thing? Hello there. Opals can be really dangerous. I'm so glad you took care of them, Bobby. Heart quests? Who's this? Argyle? Hi, hi, hello. Romance quest? Sure. I seem to have caught a chill. Would you happen to have anything that could warm me up? I seem to have caught a chill. Deliver berry tea to Argyle. Sure. Why not? Interesting. We're gonna romance Argyle, huh? Ooh, what? Bjorn! Whirlpools were the only things keeping me from sailing. I guess now I have no excuse. Friend quest? Hello. What's a friend quest? I need something hot, small, hard, and shiny. You got anything like that? Rough citrine. I have that. Hello. I've got a wild pin, but it's going to need... Oh. Deliver copper ingot. Ugh, okay. And what was that buried tea that the other guy wanted me to make? Man. Oh, I need to sell some stuff to make money. Uh. Okay. Selling all my flowers. And then we'll sell this veggie juice. There we go. That's good enough. Uh, so I need to make berry tea, right? What type of tea is that? Let's see. Grow a pink flower. Purchase a trinket from Len. Deliver berry tea to Argyle. Okay, how do we make berry tea? Berry tea. Mixed berries, tea leaves. How do I get mixed berries? Mixed berries and tea leaves. Okay, I need three of these. So I can make three mixed berries. Okay. And then what else do I need? Tea leaves? Tea leaves. Okay. Tea leaves can be found over here somewhere, right? Let's go. Whew, so we're romancing Argyle. Is that even how you pronounce his name? Okay. Let's see. 
let's make berry tea. There we go. So satisfying. Oh, add energy. I need to make an iron ingot or something, right? Copper ingot. Rough citrine. Ten rough citrine, copper ingot. Let's craft one of these. How do I get rough citrine? Rough citrine. I do have it. That's what I thought. Alright, we'll go to bed and let that finish in the morning. Not that I need energy now that I'm going to sleep, but oh well. See how much money we made? Man, the game is really freezing up today, isn't it? Ooh, 846. Nice. Wow, peach sapling was a lot. Neppy welcomed me back with enthusiasm. We ate together in that magical chasm. When their energy returns, Neppy infused my magical staff with a new spell. We return to the surface to cast it together. Whirlpools begin to reverse. And just like that, we ended the whirlpool curse. The port reopened and visitors returned. With Neppy's help, a new spell was learned. We have access to the vortex spell. Open the spell wheel with ZL to select it. Interesting. What does the vortex spell do? Talk to a lark. Oh, did my staff get did changed? Okay, is the all remove? There we go. Much better. Uh, let's talk to a lark. Ooh, let's go like this. Okay. Talk to a lark. His house is over here, I believe. Is he at his house? Lark. Is he in his house? Let's see. Yep, he is in his house. Okay. Whew. Hi, Lark. Hi, Bobby. Glad you're here. With those whirlpool downs, my to-do list is looking a lot lighter. <laughs> Bobby, I saw everything. Was that a real sprite? Did you learn a new spell? Tell me everything. Neppy was making whirlpools for fun? Huh, tell me about your new spell. Neppy infused their magical their magic to your magical staff? That's the coolest thing I've ever heard. Wow, I could be wrong, but I think this is a vortex spell. I've never actually used it myself, so I'm not exactly sure, sure exactly what it can do. You should practice using the vortex spell. My good friend Drake, w Drac? Might be able to help you, but you might be able to help you, but you can also probably figure it out on your own. Try out your new vortex spell. I bet it could be used to clear some of that weird shade that's hanging about. Oh, that's cool! A sprite traded you for a spell, for a t traded you a spell for a tasty breakfast. That's completely reasonable, actually. But you should really practice the spell to make sure you got the hang of it. Okay, I will. Let's go to the dark stuff. Okay. Let's do this. Yeah! That's amazing. Wow. 
Wow, I love that. Oh man, I used up so much of my energy. Maybe I should have saved it. <laughs> okay. Where is he? What? Alaric! Alaric! Where'd he go? Over here, huh? Okay. Alaric! Hey there! My family saves up lots for me to study magic here. I don't want to let them down. I saw some vortexes! You seem to be really getting the hang of it! Wow, Bobby, did you think you'd be slinging spells when you load up that little boat of yours and set sail for Azoria? Oh, and don't forget to visit Drac if you're ever having trouble figure out, figuring out your spells. He looks intimidating, but he's a really sweet guy. Thanks for all your help, Bobby. I still can't believe sprites are real. Last thing, I heard Eddie is looking for you. I hear he's pretty excited about the port being open again. It's still funny to think of Eddie as a sailor. He used to wander around his ranch in a cowboy hat and fancy boots. But that's his story to tell. Eddie will be so happy to hear the harbor's or open, though he probably already knows he's got a sixth sense for the sea. Okay. Amazing. Truly amazing. Okay, let's... Um... Ah! Go away! No! There we go. I need to sell some stuff. Oh, I need to buy four more cauliflower. Okay, let's go to Eddie. Oops, I was going to program it in, right? There we go. There's Eddie. Hello there. There's lots to do on the island, land lover. Lots. Talk to people, learn what you can. How's the bit fish biting today? Bobby, I can't believe you did it! It brings a tear to this old sailor's eye. I might even be ready to buy a new boat to live on. My rancher life? That was a long time ago. There's nothing wrong with farming or raising animals. I just fell in love with the sea. It's a shame that the, all the land is just sitting empty. That weird shade set in as soon as I left. Hmm. Bobby, you've shown yourself to be a capable farmer, fisher, and friend. I'd be honored if you would take over my ranch. Now I know it's not much, but there's a barn so it's ready for mamus and woolly horns. It would make me so happy to know that the place is going to get see some life again. A new house! Ahoy, Bobby! Friend quest? I need something small, hard, and shiny. You got anything like that? I sure do! There we go. How's the fish bite him today? Redeem class. Wow, so would you look at that? How do you know? Okay, I gotta see. What is my current main storyline? There's no main storyline quest right now. Purchase a trinket from Lynn. Cow's account. What happened to the friend and romance quests? Interesting. Okay. Drac. Let's go there. Let's talk to Drac or Drake or whatever it is. Whatever his name is. Man, he sure is far out here. Drac, have I got to speak to you? Hey champ, you're looking great. Quest. You got the look of someone who just learned their first magic spell, champ. Now I know what you're thinking. Drac, how can I use this spell in my daily life? Clear the mist hanging over Hazy Haven. Just like anything else, you gotta practice before you can move a master. Use your spell to clear the way to Hazy Haven. Okay. 
Here's a secret they don't want you to know. You can use the Vortex spell in and out of combat. You can use it to knock back any jumbles that have gotten too close, but you can also use it to quickly harvest crops and get rid of certain obstacles. Tell you what, try using it on the shade around Hazy Haven and then come see me, champ. Okay, where's Hazy Haven? Let's go. new house? Amazing. Was that it for the quest? 9 out of 10. Okay, there's one more. This one? Yes! Let's go talk to Drax. Okay, where is Drax? There we go. Drax! Oh man. Hey, hey! I'm impressed with how you handle those jumbles, champ. And, and? Heck yeah! Way to bend your magic to your will. Come back if you learn any new spells. Oh, hi! I really found my home in Exoria. The people, the critters, everything is just so cozy and friendly. I've run out of some of my basic ingredients. Can you pick them up for me? Blue crab? What is a blue crab? Who's that? What in the world? Oh, they're visitors! Of course. Crazy. Okay, let's see what other quests are there. Uh, August. I like to base my menu around seasonal produce. Okay. Why, hello! You must be Bobby. I'm August, and the only thing I love better than making good food is making great friends. Come chat a while. Here, have a nice cup of tea. You know, with a little preparation, you can make your own tea whenever you like. It's especially good on cold, rainy days. Would you like to learn about making hot tea? You deserve a cup of hot tea for all the running around you've been doing. Build yourself a beverage station and boil some tea leaves. Magnifique. Make a nice cup of tea. I've done that, though. Perfect. Now the first step to brewing a lovely cup of tea is to have a beverage station. With one of those, you can make all kinds of hot and cold drinks. Then look around for some tea leaves. You know, those bright yellow leaves growing wild. Add, add your tea leaves to your beverage station and voila! Hot tea! Bring me a cup of hot tea you've brewed so I can make sure you've got it right. Okay, I need to bring tea. Let's go get some tea leaves and bring them some tea. Maybe I can just use the berries. That might be easier. Yeah, let's do that. Ice tea. Green tea. Craft. Alright, and we'll bring it to... what's his name? I already forgot his name. get a ton of quests. It's the longest time I was waiting for quests, but now it's like, there's quests everywhere. 
friend quest, romance quest, regular quests. Salute, uh -huh. Bobby. Ah, uh, yes, same thing as before. Welcome back! Let me see how your tea turned out. <laughs> Wonderful! A cup of tea like this can warm you up when you're feeling chilly on a rainy day. And if you want something extra special, equipment. Experiment with adding other ingredients to your tea. I'm part partial to huckleberry tea myself. Keep using your beverage station and I'm sure you'll discover all kinds of handy and tasty concoctions. Okay, thank you. Okay, who else has a quest for me around here? Jade. In here? Hello! Yeah. Hi, I'm Jade! You might have met my older sister, Pearl. We are very much alike. Springtime is a great time to accept a new shipping contract. Hey, you're the one who opened up the port. Thanks for that. Now I can reopen my business. I'm Jade. I own the shipping warehouse in town. Well, it's the only one, but still, it's the best. This is a place to come to ship items in bulk. Bigger shipments of bigger goods mean bigger profits. Just so you know, you can make more with shipping contracts than you can selling at market tables. But don't tell my sister Pearl that. So want to give shipping contracts a try? It's time to enter the world of international trade. See what contracts are available on the board and get at them. Okay, that's the spirit. All you have to do is check the shipping contract board outside of my warehouse. Assemble all the things requested in the contract to ship them off to the island. Couldn't be easier. Now try fulfilling a shipping contract and I'll throw in a completion bonus. Okay. Sounds good to me. I'll see. Um, let's do this. There we go. Did it. Hi, Bobi. You ready to take on a new contract? Have you been hustling to get those contracts filled? You know what they say. You gotta flex that hustle muscle. Woo! Well done, my export expert. Check that shipping contract board whenever you feel like earning those florins. Interesting. Huh. I should water my plants. And then I'll come back for that other quest. Buy cauliflower seeds. Okay, time to fill up my watering can. Yeah, we need four more cauliflower seeds. Oh, we need eight now. Okay. Okay, we need eight cauliflower seeds. Bud. There we go. Cauliflower seeds. Eight cauliflower seeds. Whew. Man, I have 6,000 florins. That's amazing. Greetings. Okay. I need eight of these. Thank you. Oh, I can upgrade my pouch. Eight thousand. Never mind. Uh, what was I gonna do? Oh yeah, plant. Perfect. Okay. Uh, now let's go do, track the other quests. Merit. Hi, bud. There we go. I'm 
tracking merit. Is she the one who has the quest? Yeah, it is merit. Okay. What have you got from merit? Hello, Bobby. How are you doing, Bobby? Oh, good, Bobby. I was just looking for you. I'm glad you asked. A couple of Azorians are working on something that I think you'll enjoy. They've decided to add some spice to everyday tasks. Oh, come now. I know that you love tasks. They've set up a series of progressively harder tasks that will challenge your mind and body. Not in a scary way, mind you. You should talk to Nessa first. Make sure you have a sturdy fishing pole and get ready to be tested on your fishing ability. Are you ready to challenge yourself like you've never been challenged before? Okay, talk to Nessa. I knew it! Go find Nessa and she'll start you on your journey to becoming a master of the rod and reel. Alright, thanks, Merit. Nessa. Okay, let's do it. Is she here? Aha! Hey, I'm Nessa. I'm Azoria's resident daydreamer. I spend most of my time staring out at the sea. Just take a minute to be in the moment. There's nothing else expected of you right now but to be present. Obi, the mayor said I should be expecting you. I hope you're ready for my devi devious devised, deviously devised fishing trial. It's two freshwater fish. Man, I haven't gone fishing in a while. Butterfish? Anywhere? Oh, there's one. that completed the quest for her. Next dock. No, I was right. Oh, she's not here. Is she over here? Where's Nessa? Oh, she's further this way. Okay, that makes sense. What? I thought I did catch freshwater fish. Catch two freshwater fish. What type of- is that not the type of fish that I caught? Okay, interesting. Pink flower, purchase a trinket from Len. Fishing, catch two freshwater fish. Oh, wait, what was that? Mm. Oh, well. What other quests are there? 
Now let's see if I can sell the fish. Wow, I am not selling a lot today, huh? Oh, my inventory is full. No, let's keep those. Let's cook them. Maybe we should cook all of these. Yeah, let's cook. And then I can sell them for more money. Ooh, hold on. that up in a sec. First I gotta cook. Okay. Now let's pick up that butterfly. Moon moth. go to bed. There's really no other main quest right now. Talk to you? Huh? Hey! I'm worried I'm gonna run out of books. I can only bring so much on- too many on the ship. Goodbye. Okay. Let's go to bed. Nobody in storyline quests yet. Oh, new mail from Eddie. Made 232 coins. Nice. Oh, look at me. Hello, Bobby. It's about time that we met. They call me the Wisp Mother, and the, uh, this island is under my care. I must admit, I haven't been doing such a great job. The sprites have had their way long enough. I've been wait watching you since you arrived, and I think you may be able to help. Come see me, and I'll tell you more about the island. There's more to Azoria than what you've seen. You'll need to use the Vortex spell to clear the way. The Gate to Another Realm. Ooh. Chapter 4. Find the Wisp Mother. Ahoy, Bobby! There's a couple of things I wanted to let you know about the property. Before anything else, you're going to want to get some fresh air in there. Maybe one of your new spells will do the trick? Also, there's a barn in there for you to use. You can get mammoths mammoths for milk and woolly horns for wool. These guys are for sale with Jeremiah if the ranch life calls to you. How do I find the wisp mother? Do I just wander around? Could it be at that island over there? I guess we'll just run around and look for her, huh? There we go. Find the Wisp Mother. Hmm. Where can she be? Maybe over here somewhere? Hazy Haven. Ooh, could this be it? Okay, let's check this path. 
Wow, pretty. Candelabra. Ooh. Ooh. Ah. Mossy stone path. Nice. Is she up here? Yes! I can't believe I found her! Hey! Go meet the Wisp Mother. Mm -hmm. Welcome! Azoria is a very special place. I consider myself lucky to have been part of its foundation. Thank you for finding me, Bobby. It's been too long since I made my presence known. I am called the Wisp Mother. I have been here for a very long time. Most of the magic in Azoria e comes either from me or my sprites. You've met Nepi, but there's also Bulletal, Grell, and Flamo. They're lovely creatures who mean no harm, but they, they don't see the consequences of their actions. Thank you for treating Nepi with such care. Can I give you a gift to help you with your travels on Azoria? How would you like a pair of wings, Bobby? What? Yes, please. I'll need a couple ingredients. Would you be able to collect what I need? Oh, were you wondering who I was? I'm the Wisp Mother, and I'm hoping to, you'll learn to love Azoria as much as I do. You'll be able to explore the, our land much better with a pair of fairy wings, don't you think? Craft and place Lowlands Critter Conservatory. Collect flutter dust by placing butterflies in a Lowlands Critter Conservatory and waiting. Deliver flutter dust to Wisp Mother. Okay. Critter Conservatory, huh? This is going to be very interesting. Well, don't I have a new house now? I could, I could put it near there. Perfect. What if I put it here? Critter Conservatory. Five stone brick, five beach lumber, and silt. Okay. Beach lumber, stone bricks, and silt. Beach lumber, stone bricks, and silt. Beach lumber. Oh, that's not my intention. Okay. trees are growing. Okay. Silt is going to be harder to find. Okay. Whew. Let's see. To build the Critter Conservatory, I need... Five beach lumber. Beach lumber. That's here. There we go. And then I need five stone bricks. Okay. stone. Okay. Is there any stone around here? Aha! And then I need to find silt. should be enough. I need five stone bricks. I'm making three, I think. Three, yes. Two more. Okay, and then I need silt. How much silt do I need? It's fourteen silt. I need fourteen silt. Okay. Time to explore.
Perfect. Perfect. That was not my intention, but okay. Oops. Perfect. Now let's go build it. Should I build it near my first home or near my second home? Hmm. Hey, heart quest. No time. Okay. Just wait for these to be done. This is so cool. Two more. Last one. Oh, you want to be petted? There you go. Okay. Now I should have five stone bricks, correct? Three? Okay, they're making, it's making the next two. What do we do while we wait? Let's check out the land right now. Would this be a good place for a critter conservatory? Yeah, maybe this would be where I should put it. I can put it right here. Yeah. Okay, that's it. Now we just gotta... Are there right now? Hmm, no specific quests. Probably friend quests, so. Let's just wait for these to be done. What's this? Interesting. Huh, I didn't even realize I had that. Alright, it's almost done. Let's just wait. Man, I might need some more coal soon. I'm definitely gonna need more copper soon. Almost there. And collect. Ah, this one's done too. Okay, let's go build it right over here, near my new house. Mm, let's build it right here. Collect flower dust by placing butterflies in lowland. Interesting. How do we do that? Oh, I need to bring. Oh, cool. Butterflies. Okay, let's. Let's collect butterflies. There's one. That's not a butterfly. Butterflies? Three butterflies. 
Let's go back. Four butterflies. Nice. Okay. Collect flutter dust by placing three butterflies into... Okay. Do we just wait? How long do we wait? Do we come back? Deliver flutter dust to list with mother. I have one flutter dust, don't I? Yeah, I do. Okay. Well, now we wait, bud. I'm gonna try communicating with critters. Now that I have an amateur critter collector thing in Bob. I want to see if I can speak to more than just frogs. Hey, <laughs> critter! Look at this tall thing over there! Think you can talk to us? What do you got to say for yourself, tall thing? Goodbye. there some kind of tall thing that talks to us we'll split it out what do you want i just want your critter riff hey bud good day there aren't a lot of activities for those exploring intellectual pursuits on azoria hmm. out of my way i'm fluttering over here you got something to say for yourself Pretty cool. What do we need here? Emerald seal. Okay. Man, it's hard to use here. Apologies, my tall friend. I hadn't realized you were trying to speak to me. Tell me, what can I do for you? Nothing. I just want the critter with. Okay, now we should go back. Ooh, hold on. <laughs> hey, what we got there? Some kind of tall thing that talks to us? Well, sit out. What do you want? I want the critter rift. Okay. There we go. Alright, let's go to bed. Oh, wait, maybe we can talk to the bumblebee first. Oh man, same dialogue. Okay. Let's go to bed. Maybe we can collect all this stuff and sell it. <sighs> oh, 
Oh, nothing's on the table. Oh no. Iron ore. That seems good enough. Let's go to sleep. Then we'll, in the morning, we'll water all these plants. <sighs> Alright. How much money do we make? 342. Okay. Oof. Oh, plants are watered again. Hey. So one, two, three, twelve. We need twelve turnips. And then we'll check on the conservatory. There we go. Let's sell some stuff. Let's check on the critic conservatory. Ooh. Bug juice. Interesting. Perfect. Let's go to the wisp mother. Uh, I think she's this way. Nope. Wrong way. up here. Oh. Deliver flutter dust. Oh. Hello there. People from all over the world, all over the known world come together to found Azoria. These varied backgrounds brought us strength. Here the island can only be reached by one with wings. Bring me what I need and I'll make you some. Give me a moment and I'll conjure your wings. Yay! There you are, your very own set of wings. Now, my magic isn't strong enough to let you fly, but these will let you jump much higher. With these wings, you'll be able to access areas of Zoria that you've not yet seen. Now that that's taken care of, there's something more serious I need to tell you about. It's not just the mild, wild magic that makes Azoria special, but there's also the Fey Gate. It's a door that controls passage between your world and a far different one. We call that realm, that place, the Fey Realm. It has been many years since I had to seal it shut, and the island has changed so much that it might be hard to find. Would you be able to locate the Fey Gate and see if it still has some magic? It will be glowing if it does. 
I can, I can see much, but some parts of Azoria are unclear even to me. Please check on the old portal, my child. Find a mysterious portal. Okay. I have one place in mind that it could be. But, I'm, yeah, I'm gonna check that. And if it's not there... It says I can jump higher, but I feel like I, I'm jumping the same height. Hmm. Interesting. There was one place in mind that I thought of when she said there's a portal, and it's this way. Serious portal. Yes, I knew it. Return to Wisp Mother for rewards. Woo! I can't believe I found it like that. Spooky woods. Huh. Return to Wisp Mother for rewards. Okay. talk to the, what do you call it? Oops. The flower patch. Nice. Okay, let's talk to the wisp mother. Hello, my child. Zora is a very special place. I consider myself lucky to have been part of its foundation. And Bobby, have you seen the glow of the gate? Does it still have magic? Good. Then there's an important matter we must discuss. There's a hidden part of Azoria on the other side of that gate. In the Fey Realm, there exists wonderful creatures and plants the likes of which you've never seen, tended to by kind and generous elves. Why did I seal the gate? Well, because something terrible happened in the Fey Realm. A strange mist, a miasma we call it, began to seep from the floating ruins. At first, I thought nothing of it. Then the humans that lived there started to get sick. As the miasma spread further and further, the humans in the Fey Realm were forced to leave through the Fey Gate. Finally, the miasma reached the Fey Gate, and much to my despair, began to seep out to the human side of Azoria. I sealed the gate and asked the Azorians to forget about it and the Fey Realm. It was for their protection. I couldn't let anyone accidentally travel through. But the time has come to open the gate and unite the two parts of Azoria. I suspect I know the source of the miasma, and I think you are the only person capable of stopping it. I'll need a series of ingredients to help me harness enough magic to open the gate. Will you fetch them for me? Gem polisher, polished citrine, polished aquamarine, polished peridot, polished topaz. Okay. Gem polisher, huh? That seems doable. Gem polisher. Do I have one of those? Is that what this is? Cooking hearth. Not this. No. I need to build a gem polisher. Gem polisher. Two iron ingots. Okay. Now we can make a gem polisher. Thank goodness all my crops are watered. Man, I really like this. This is so cool. <sighs> Let's harvest the eggs in the cuckoo. looks like a good place to end off this episode next time we'll be building the gem polisher um thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this episode so today we we got some real good progress on the main story we finished helping neppy then we discovered the wisp mother and then we discovered a portal to another realm 
and there's this miasma seeping through? That's so interesting. Um, I think it's gonna be really fun to go through the portal, see what's on the other side. Are we mortal? Are we gonna be in danger of the miasma? There's also that freezing section that I really want to check out. Um, I'm sure we can't get there yet though, but once we do, I think it'll be really fun. But anyway, we've made really good progress in this game, and I'm really enjoying it so far. I hope you are too. Um, and if you are, feel free to leave a like, comment, subscribe if you'd like, any of that stuff. It's really appreciated. And yeah, hopefully I see you in the next episode. Bye!